Yes! Everybody, we are actually flying! Our plane is flying! Mmm, yes, everybody. In today's video, let's go ahead and visit an old friend of ours, everybody. Kerbal Space Program. Hmm. Yes, Kerbal Space Program, one of the most legendary games out there or simulators out there. I mean, look at the reviews on Steam right here. Overwhelmingly positive. It's so rare to see a game or literally anything on Steam being rated as overwhelmingly positive. And well, let me just say, it deserves this rating. This is just absolutely crazy of a game. You know, it's been out for like a bit of a while now, six years, which is quite crazy. And well over the past six years, it's developed so so much. Yes, to the two people, you know, watching this video that don't know what KSP is yet, basically it's a simulator where you can build your own plane, your own rockets, and explore the universe with it, and fly around space and stuff, and do this. And you have these little, like, alien looking, I think these are called Kerbals, that are your passengers. And basically they can die when you build something that crashes. Everybody, that's the best thing I've ever seen. Yeah, you know, you can explore the universe, and that's quite crazy. There's not much you can't do. So today's video, I would like to dedicate to this game again and build our own plane after having not played it for like two years. Yes. Start game. Let's go. Mmm. Look at this guy. Is that a Dufly or aeroplane? All right, let's just start a new game. What should we call our aeroplane? Oh my God. I can't believe this actually. I know what. I have no, I have no idea. I'll go about 737 max. Okay. Sandbox. Yeah, we're going to go to the sandbox mode so we can have all the tools we need to buy, build it. 737 max. Let's go. Oh. Alrighty, so welcome to our little campus right here. It's called the Space Center, and there's a lot of stuff you can do. But just go to the hangar and build our plane here, right? The space plane hangar, and here we are. This is quite easy. We can now build our own aeroplane. So we've got stuff like pods, engines, fuel tanks, structural stuff, wings, landing gear, and all that stuff. All we need to build our max. All right, so let's just go ahead and start with the cockpit right here. This one is actually smiling at me a little bit here. This MK3 cockpit. Yes. Hmm. Kind of looks close. This is 737, or maybe the space shuttle. It looks pretty nice. Good. Let's also start. What do we got right here? Payload. We can add a cargo bay. Now we don't want that. Can we add like a passenger cabin? Where's that? Okay, there we go. We've got the MK3 passenger module. Here we go. We can now put that here onto our interesting aeroplane. Good. Pretty sure that's how they actually built the Max as well, judging by the quality of it. Here we go. Yes. That looks good. That's enough passenger space for now. Let's go ahead and now continue with the wings, I guess. I mean, I have to know somewhat how to build an aeroplane, so I think this will be quite easy. Uh, structural wing. That sounds good. Here we go. Um, that is kind of small. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, man. Oh, look at... Oh, damn. That was quite a speeding... Whatever that was. Sorry. All right. Uh, I guess we need a proper wing for this. Or should we just ironically try to fly with this wing as well? If that's actually a funny thing. I mean, seriously, we're, we're like normal wings. Right, this one's just as small. I mean, if you were to put like enough wings on here, then somehow we'll be able to take off eventually. Okay, never mind. That's not how it works. Does it? Okay, anyway. All right, anyway, let's just get rid of that and just fly our aeroplane right here. And just try to find like something that's good. Aeroplane main wing. All right, it doesn't look good. Honestly, this is one of the ugliest plane wings I've ever seen in my life. But that's just great to see. Let's go ahead and put it somewhere here. Here we go. That looks good now. Now on the other side, it's time for this wing. Here we go. All right. It looks looks a little bit ugly. Okay. So what is there to move on with? I mean, okay. There's this nose code. Maybe that's a good idea. All right. Maybe this one still too big. <laughs> Doesn't this look like an Apple pencil now? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, this one will do. Uh, here's a smaller nose cone right here. That's too small. Uh, but there we go. Now we found it. Yes. Now it's time for a bit of a tail section of the zero plane, of course. How do we do that? Maybe we can design the tail section has a bit of a fuel tank here as well. That looks good. And let's now add like a few wings to this, right? Got some tail wings. This should be the vertical stabilizer. There we go. That looks, that looks good. Elevator surfaces. Good. Here we go. Probably still flies better than the max. Here we go. And I think that's a good tail section right here. Let's go ahead and now add a bit of a landing gear. How does that work? We've got a few things right here. Steerable land. That, that sounds good. Here we go. Right, this might be just a little bit small, but uh, I think this could work. Let's go ahead and add some fixed main landing gear to this one right here. This is uh, working very well. Okay, there we go. We've got some properly good landing gear. This is probably going to go so wrong. Let's just hope no Reiner pilot ever touches this. All right, now it's time for the finishing touch. A few engines, please. For those, let's go ahead and, you know, go for a bit of a more, I guess, spacey design. Let's put them to the back of the aeroplane. This one is, uh... Not the right size. Ah, there we go. That looks a much better, very big one. Let's go ahead, actually, now. See if it can fly. Now, let's see what crew could be on board. I mean, there's a lot of empty seats here in those passenger modules. Anyway, we've got four pilots on board. Let's go ahead. Okay, launch. It's now time to see if our 737 Max flies. Probably still put more work and more care into... 
this mod. All right, everybody, we've got a live view of all the pilots. Let's go ahead and see. Can we fly this aeroplane? Yes, full power. Let's go. Come on. Oh, yeah. Let's give us some throttle right here, please. Hello. Help. Come into the cockpit view. Low cockpit view. All right, this is our pilots. Looks uh, very trustworthy, but for some reason, the throttle doesn't work. Come on. How do we do this? Axis groups. All right, let's just assign this right here. And this one as well. This is yaw. This should be, of course, the vertical stabilizer. And then we have roll. I guess that's, of course, going to be the uh, ailerons of this. Please work. And then, and then, of course, we have throttle here. God, this is a bit complicated. I hope this works now. So I've added some, like, actions here to those things. Help. All right, come on. Launch now. All right, come on. Full power now. Let's go. That doesn't work. I mean, the thing is, though, actually, as you can tell, though, pitch and stuff like that works. That's uh, actually something I'm very much proud of for a start. That looks good. Ah, okay, there we go. Oh, no, we have to activate the engine, don't we? All right, full power. Let's go. Why isn't it working? All right, come on, does this work now? Activate? Oh, yes! Yes, all right. All right, everybody, we've got engine power. All right, I accidentally made this work. Okay, here we go. Ailerons work as well, so this will be a very highly successful flight. Good. Yes, look at our old pilots here. All right, everyone has survived. Everyone's uh, still alive. That's actually a good thing. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, um, dear pilot, this hasn't gone well. You're the problem, though. You're the problem. Good. Half our plane is still alive. Sorry. Let's maybe go back. Yeah, to be honest, what might have gone wrong here was the landing gear placement. Yeah, most of the aeroplane was still up. Yeah, let's add some more landing gear. I think this could work. Go fixed landing gear. That'll do on this side. And on this side as well. Make it nice and stable, this aeroplane. As you can see, yeah, my genius is almost frightening here. Look at that. This will fly so well. Yeah, that's not a very good. Let's try this anyway. Come on, active engine. Here we go. Yes, let's go full power right here. You know what? Not actually full power. Maybe go like... Uh oh. All right, Pegasus Airline. Yeah, maybe I should improve the landing gear quite a bit. Honestly, this is <clears throat> not very good. Second try. Full power. Maybe that's the way to do this. Just take off somehow. Oh, no. I'm sorry, pilots. All right, they're still alive, aren't they? Good. Yeah, this is a massive failure, dude. First of all, this plane is way too long. Let's go ahead and change that part. There we go. Much better. Let's maybe try some uh, bigger landing gear right here. Oh, yeah. That's what I like. That's some nice big landing gear. Extra large. Perfect. This now uh, looks like a good plane to, sorry, uh, to fly. It's going to go super well now, this test flight. All right. Come on. Let's spawn in. Uh, oh, maybe the nose landing gear is a little bit tall. But anyway, let's try this anyway. Come on. Activate engine. There we go. Full power. Good. Let's maybe see. Is there an explosion? Please don't, there, don't let there be an explosion. Yes! Everybody, we are actually flying. Our plane is flying. Barely. And we've got a lot of passengers on board. Oh my god, no. We were in the air, though. That's gone well. I want to do this again. Revert to launch. Yeah, let's try this again. I mean, this worked perfectly fine. Activate engine. Here we go. Yes, and now full throttle. Good. Perfect. There we go. And look at this nice little landing gear tilt. Can you see that? Oh, oh no, 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 no. Let's not crash. Let's go ahead and stay on the runway. No, no crash, please. Oh, there's passengers on board. All right, everyone's died. Sorry. I mean, I mean, this is still alive, right? Flight events. We can see so many flight events. Everyone's died here. Sorry, Mr. Kerman. Yeah, as it turns out, first of all, I should have probably gone for a bit of a better landing gear placement still. But as it turns out, I don't even have aileron control. I do have rudder control. That's fine. And elevators, but I have no ailerons. So controlling this plane in the air is not really a thing. But we're actually flying. Uh oh. I like how we still have this one of the landing gears here. Um, but actually, you know what? We're flying. We can go into the cockpit view. Check this out. Hello, dear passenger. Oh my god, ocean. All right, we're going to end up like Sully, aren't we? All right, there's so many view. Uh, this is oh, yeah. We can actually have the passenger view as well. Hello, passengers. This is going well. And oh my god. We are, I think, at a very fast speed, aren't we? That's good. I think we are actually breaking the sound barrier, dude. Yeah, 300 meters per second. That's almost the sound barrier. Okay, we're about to crash into the ocean. All right, and oh. Actually, everyone's still alive, isn't it? That's great. Yes, yeah, everybody, time for some improvements right here. Perfect. Thing is, apparently, this wing does not have ailerons built in. So, there's no way to actually control, well, roll in midair. Hmm. For that one to work, I guess we need to add these control surfaces here. That will make sense. I guess that could that could work right here. That looks good. Yes, what a great idea. Good. Control surfaces are here now. Let's go ahead and give them some action right here. Perfect. This couldn't be better. Let's go ahead and launch now. Alrighty. Oh, landing gear still doesn't work properly. Sorry. Okay, now apparently... Uh, actually, this doesn't work too well. Uh, yeah, the control surfaces are a little bit very reactive. But that's another story. Let's go ahead and fly this aeroplane now. Come on. Oh, no, this is going to be a miss. All right, anyway, come on. Act 
activate engine. Here we go. Full power. Looking good. Turn to the left, please. Uh oh. No. Ah. Oh, we've lost our wing. We've sorry. We've lost the pilots. Probably. All right. <clears throat> Second try. Here we go. Yes. Now full power. Good. Let's take off. Here we go. We have taken off our aeroplane. It does fly, kinda. Oh no. Oh, never mind. Oh, all the pilots are dead. Everyone's dead. Great. Yeah, building this stuff is not too easy. Highest altitude reached 160 meters. I mean, flight is flight. You have to appreciate. All right. So, uh, <clears throat> wait a second. <clears throat> wait. Yeah. <clears throat> Let me just uh, load in my other project. Yeah, here, this is just another project I uh, built um, the other day. I wanted to make, you know, a 747. Let's go ahead and do this. All right, activate engine. Here we go. Yes. Look at that. Yes, that looks good. Take off, full power. Yes, looks good. Everything works. We still have our old broken plane here. Sorry. 747 is taken off. Doesn't this look good? Right, come on, full power, please. Oh, no. Oh, no, please don't crash. This is why we cannot have anything nice. So yeah, guys, <clears throat> this video has been an absolute fader. Nothing really is working here. That's good. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. As always, good night. Oh. Now, thank you to all my members here on YouTube, like Spice, Robbie, Middle Aged, Levi, Junk in the Trunk, Mubarak, Darren K, Oh Man, Moritz, John, Kelly Chaos, Death Rider, uh, Ragings, Noah, Yes Aviation, British Loser, One, Saturn, Cat, Sunno, Shadow, New, New York, and Jackie Boy.